You're now watching Fresh Rex TV. Yo, yo, welcome everyone back to the channel. Welcome back to a new video. A video I was not expecting to upload, but you know, these type of scenarios happen and I couldn't resist this deal. Of course, the title of the video, the thumbnail, and what's most important about this video is this car right here in front of me. This is my new to me 2008 Acura TSX in a six speed manual which I'll get to that here in a few. Pretty rare gem. Um, I just recently got rid of my FG2. You know, a little sad to let that one go. Not that I didn't like it, but this is definitely something that's been on my radar for a while. And this car is pretty unique and pretty rare to me to obtain and own. And I'm super blessed about it. Um, this car speaks for itself. I mean, it's super, super well maintained. I'm the third owner now. Shout out to Charles, man, if you're watching this. Thank you so much for the deal and the opportunity. Such a blessing. Shout out to you and your family, man. This car is truly one of a kind. Like I mentioned, something I've been wanting for a while. Um, definitely my first Acura and probably be my last. <laughs> uh, don't plan to get any other cars. I mean, I've had my fair share. This is definitely something I want to keep in my collection probably forever. Um, it's in the Nighthawk Black Pearl. Super, super clean, super well maintained. The paint, I mean, this thing is pretty much almost mint. I would say about a nine out of 10 condition. Headlights, everything just OEM fresh, super stock, super clean. Um, no flaws whatsoever. Little paint chips here and there, but that doesn't bother me whatsoever. I've always, always loved the front end on these. They look so aggressive, so nice. And Maybe a front lip here soon one day. <laughs> Trying to take it easy on this one. It's going to be my daily driver, but I'm going to just have fun with it and enjoy everything about it. The wheels, as you can tell, they're most likely off of a Honda Accord, I think he told me. Um, about, I would say, 05 to 08. Correct me if I'm wrong, but Honda Accord wheels in 17-inch. They don't look too bad, but I do plan to go a li little bit different route, maybe a more OEM type of style, so I'll definitely be switching those up, or who knows, maybe some aftermarket wheels later on. It is lowered on function and form coilovers, type one, I believe. So it is a little low. I do like it this low, but just for everyday commute, everyday driving, I will raise it a little bit, but it does look really, really good just the way it sits. Um, let me see what else. The paint, like I said, is super, super good condition. You do not see them in these kind of conditions. I love the dual pipe, the dual tips. It is a four cylinder, if people don't know. They made these in uh, 04 to 08. 06 to 08 got that facelift, which I truly, absolutely love. That's the one I've always wanted. This being the 08 is just way more an achievement to me to having the last year that they made this generation to be particular. And I've always wanted one of these, like I mentioned multiple times. Um, the dual pipe, I do love those a lot. I love how it says Acura TSX. I mean, this car almost seems like it just came out, even though it's an 08. Um, quite frankly, looks a lot better than most of these cars rolling out today. <laughs> no disrespect to anyone out there. Um, I love that little tint right there on the reverse lights. Everything about this car just screams like, you know, a daily commuter, but it also can have a little fun. It has definitely a little bit of pep in its step. Of course, with it being six-speed manual, very rare for this spec. Um, there's so much opportunity, so much routes you could go. You could daily drive this, track it, stance it. I'm just truly trying to have fun with it and know everything about the build and know everything about the platform. Like I mentioned, my first Acura, but these things are just a blast. Let me show you off the interior. Like I said, super, super mint, very well taken care of. As you can tell right here, this thing is by far immaculate pretty much. He kept it in real, real good condition. So you guys, the rear seats, just mint, no flaws whatsoever, no tears, no rips. I mean, it's like if I'm almost the first owner, it seems like. <laughs> Love the stick shift right there, pause, it's crazy. All weather floor mats, OEM. I love those little nice touches. It's always nice to have the OEM stuff, especially since most of the stuff on this thing is discontinued, unfortunately. Show you guys the trunk. Just a quick overview of this car, man. I mean, 
As you can tell, I'm pretty excited about it. TSX cargo mat, the original floor mats, mint condition. Everything is just flawless on this thing. Close is amazing. All the doors close right. Look at that, beautiful. Give you guys a quick startup just to see everything working mechanically. I love the speedometer too, it looks super, super cool. Super stock, <laughs> no exhaust, maybe later on, who knows. But just overall how it looks here in the cockpit looks amazing. Super low miles, I got this thing with about 147 right now and still purring like a kitten. Let me turn it off here for you guys. Show you guys the engine because this thing is super clean. Kind of hard to do one hand, bear with me that up right there so yeah super stock here k24 my first k24 ever six speed manual transmission looks like just the engine intake was the only thing done on this otherwise everything's stock ac works perfect everything works super super great one more time with that shot of the front end with the hood open looks crazy but yeah super impressed super blessed to own one of these honestly and Definitely going to be a part of my collection. I'm super happy to have it on my fleet. And shout out to everyone out there with TSXs, the whole Acura community. I'm glad to be a part of it, glad to be a part of the family. I mean, super happy this is my first one to say. And I super, super enjoy this car. And man, I'm just very excited to get after it and dive deep into it and start making everything adjustments and tapping in with the outside world and the aftermarket world out there there's a lot of people on board with this chassis in particular but a lot of custom people that make stuff too so shout outs once again to everyone out there with the tsx co7 co9 is what they mostly call them a lot a lot of parts out there i'm sure that i'll be trying to obtain a lot of accord euro r stuff and lots and lots of bits and pieces spoon mugen makes a lot of stuff mugen um Headlights, I do want to change those. Like I said, the wheels, I want to raise it a little bit. Just give it a nice little touch, uh, OEM fresh look, and make this thing a lot more of a tank and more stiff, more reliable and bulletproof, to be honest, because I'm going to drive the hell out of this thing. <laughs> and definitely keeping it in nice condition, of course. I do not want it to leave how it looks like this. I mean, this thing is super, super pretty and i truly enjoy it um let me know what you guys think comment down below like comment and subscribe of course like i said my new my new to me 2008 acura tsx which still sounds crazy to even say that <laughs> to me this is in my opinion right comment down below if you think different um you know it was either this fa5 or rsx type s um, I feel like this is all in one, you know, this is this is the Integra four-door revamped This is the FA5 more luxury with still the power Aside from the LSD, but I mean I could put that on later on RSX type S. I mean a little compact a little small Even though these are I would say a little bit bigger, but so much more room for activities and so much more fun uh, RSX type S was something I definitely definitely wanted but you know this one just stole my heart and this is the one I chose super happy with my purchase i could look at this car all day i could talk about this car all day <laughs> um yeah lots and lots of stuff i want to do but i'm gonna just have fun with it stay tuned for more videos on this thing and it's gonna be quite a bit of a transformation i don't plan to let this go it's not for sale super super mint and i'm excited to get after it like i said multiple times <laughs> um but yeah wheels will change here soon little bits and pieces i'm gonna do little cosmetic stuff there's lots and lots of stuff i've already been looking and eyeing you know but just wanted to show you guys all the videos have been doing tremendous super super blessed on all the videos that have been happening and i want to keep going after it, it keeps uploading new stuff you know new show me your rides is on the way of course but this is a quick little pause in my normal routine videos but i definitely could not pass this up and not show you guys so Shout out to everyone watching. Don't forget, guys, once again, like, comment, and subscribe. I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace.